This is my starting squad on Ultimate Team. This is the default. <laughs> this is the players that they gave me to start off the game. Look at this. Everyone is rated 59. They had Kendrick Perkins at point guard. They put Aaron Brooks at small. F <laughs> I don't even know how they classified these players. Why would Kendrick Perkins be my backup point guard? That's hilarious. <laughs> oh. Yo, that's my team so far. The default team. So what I did is obviously there are packs you could purchase. There's fantasy challenges. So what I did is I decided to buy a few packs just to get my, my year off started, right? And the best packs on NBA Live is always the featured ones because they're available for a limited time and they give you the best value as well. So out of these three packs, there's a pack of 95, which is insane. There's 60 and there's 40. Honestly, I didn't want too many packs. I just wanted like 20 or something like that, but these are the best value. So I had to, t I took the lowest one. And also out of these three bundles, you could see that they give you different bonuses. And out of the three bonuses, I preferred Donovan Mitchell over JJ Redick and Victor Oladipo. So that's why I, ch I chose this. It has fewer packs. And also I prefer the player that they are giving as a bonus. That is why I chose this. And if you view the details of each pack, you can see the percentages of each overall player that you could get. You could get 75 overall players at 100%, 78 at 41, 80 at 13, and 82 at 3%. So here we go guys, I'm going to be opening up 40 packs. <laughs> Hopefully you guys are ready man, let's go. Oh wait, what am I doing? I already have it. <laughs> Alright, here we go. First pack of the day. Let's go. Hopefully it's a good one. We get Courtney Lee. Chris Webber. Delon Wright. So I got five pieces in this pack. So what I realized is that in these bundles, they reduce the amount of cards you get because I remember on Live 18, you get, I think eight to nine and now you're getting five cards per pack. So you're getting less cards. And also what they did is, I don't know how the rating system works, but I heard that there's different versions of each player. So that's why the ratings are very up and down right now. We get Ty Lawson, okay. So that's how the rating is right now. But I don't really understand myself, but from what I've seen, there's different ratings, different type of players, different type of cards. Like I've seen some players with four different ratings already. <laughs> so here we go, we got pack number three, Kevin Martin from the Minnesota Timberwolves, 2013-2014. Got Al Harrington throwback. Kevin Martin, this is exactly what I'm saying. Two different cards for the same player. 69, 78. He dropped down big from 2013 to 2014. Look at that, from 78 to a 69. Okay. You know what I'm gonna do actually? I'm gonna open up the Donovan Mitchell pack right now just to see how it is. Because we already know what we're gonna get, so why not open it, right? There you go, oh yeah. This is March 3rd, 2018. 84 speed, 71 3, 78 defense, not too bad. I thought his 3 would be a little bit higher, maybe like a 75, but that's all good. And I think I could sell it this card, which is good. So if ever in the future I want to sell it, I'll do that. Because I remember in Live 18, there's some cards or some rewards that you can't sell. You could only keep it on your, on your team, you can't sell it at all. So that's a good thing to see. So 37 more packs to go, Greg Monroe. So what I'm gonna do guys, I think I'm gonna open the first 10 packs with you guys and I'm gonna fast forward the others because I feel like it's gonna take forever to open up all these packs. And whenever there's a good card that I really, really like, I'm just gonna pause it probably and just slow motion or something and talk about it. <laughs> For the first 10 packs, I'm going to be- Ooh, Russell Westbrook! Let's go! 
Okay. Okay. 80 speed, 71 defense, 62 3. This right here, I don't understand the ratings though. Which, like, which version of Russell Westbrook this is? It says 2013, 2014. But I'm still, I'm still new to this. My team on, uh, I mean, Ultimate Team on Life 19. So I probably just don't understand what the card is, but it's okay. <laughs> I'll learn it eventually. But it's still Russell Westbrook. All right, we got. I'm gonna do five more packs with you guys. Let's go! Got Nene, Nene, another Kendrick Perkins, Jeremy Evans from the Hawks, Michael Ray Richardson throwback, 1978, 1979, get the Phoenix jersey. So while I'm opening these packs, uh, I'm also going to be doing, I'm going to be continuing my career for my NBA 2K19 player. So I made a lockdown. Ooh, PJ Tucker at 79, okay. I like this one. He has defense. 85 defense, 76-3. Randy Wilkins, Ian Clark. That's perfect. Defense and three-point shooting. Because that's exactly what I was talking about. <laughs> With my 2K19 player, he's a defensive um, sharpshooter. Defensive lockdown. But let's, or should you say sharpshooting... Lockdown, sharp shooting defender, I don't know, but it's a two-way player basically. Defense and some shooting. So that's the build I made. So I'm gonna be posting that this weekend as well. So look forward to that. We get Harrison Barnes, Vince Carter, Daniel Theus, Ish Smith, Target Center. So I'm excited to see that. Two more packs, let's go. Jeff Hornacek, sec. Oh yeah. Is that Amari Stoudemire? Is that Amari Stoudemire? It is Amari Stoudemire. Only a 74 rating though. I don't understand that. <laughs> so like I said guys, I'll be opening, I'll be doing my team. I mean, I keep saying my team, but it's ultimate team. I'll be doing ultimate team. I'll be doing uh, my career for my 2K19 player. Ooh, Jason Williams. Is that Hakeem? Oh. <laughs> Yo, this pack right here I got was it's straight amazing. Yo, J. Will, Hakeem in the same pack. Oh my goodness. And Jimmy Butler. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be fun. Alright, so the video, I think it's been eight minutes already. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fast forward the rest. Uh, and then um, I'll just highlight everything a bit later at the end. So I'll see you guys then. So just watch it. <laughs> All right.
All right, after all those pack openings, this is my final lineup for now. I got Jason Williams at point guard, Donovan at shooting guard, Iggy at small forward, Kmart at power forward, The Dream at center. At my bench, I got Penny, Vince Carter, PJ Tucker, Ersan Ilyasova, Steven Adams, and I also have Elgin Baylor and CJ McCollum. And I'll just show you guys, hold up, I'll show you guys all my players if ever. You feel like I made a bad decision or something, just let me know if you guys prefer to put me, uh, sorry, for me to put a certain player over a certain player. So for example, I'm going to go on Vince Carter. You know, if ever you feel like, we all go on shooting guards. If ever you feel like I should put someone else, just let me know. So these are all the shooting guards I had. I had six pages of shooting guards. So these are the first two pages I got. The last, I'm not going to show it. Um, small forwards I got these guys these are all my reserves I mean my inventory so eventually I have to sell all these players but if you feel like they should be on my starting lineup or on my bench over the players that I chose just let me know Scotty man I would have loved to put him on the squad but the ratings on this on this card is pretty low and James Worthy as well for a legend I feel like it's pretty pretty low Shane Battier as well Giannis was only like a, a 60 something, can you believe it? He's the cover athlete of 2K19 and on this game right now, on that edition that I have on that card, he's a 60 something. And Kyle Korver is labeled as a power forward, that's hilarious. <laughs> Kyle Korver is a power forward. You know one player I really wanted to put was Karl Malone, but look at his ratings, he's only a 69. Karl Malone is 69. And you know what's funny? Look, I'm gonna go into my centers, and even Kendrick Perkins at the moment is rated higher than Karl Malone. That's hilarious. Kendrick Perkins is a 71, Karl Malone was a 69. Maybe I should put Jermaine O'Neal over Steven Adams. What do you guys think? I think I'm actually gonna do that really quick. Because Jermaine O'Neal has that throwback vibe. You know, I like throwback players. Steven Adams, Jermaine have one point in speed difference, 69 to 68. Mid range is the same, finishing ability is the same, three point. Jermaine has a better stat, but I'm not gonna shoot threes with Jermaine O'Neal, obviously. The only area where Steven Adams is beating Jermaine O'Neal right now is the post up game and a little bit on the rebounding. But Jermaine O'Neal has seven points better in defense, which is really, really good. So I think I'll rather have the 7 point differential in defense over the 11 points in post up and the 3 points in rebounding. So I think I'm going to just do that, try him out. If ever, if ever I feel like it doesn't work out, I'll just put Steven Adams, it doesn't hurt. So I'm just going to put Jermaine O'Neal for now. So let me know what you guys think of my lineup of the pack opening in general. It's going to take a long time to put all my inventory onto the market because I, um, I have so many cards to sell. I have over, let's see how many, I have 28 pages of cards to put on the market. You know how long that's going to take? <laughs> but anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you guys are playing all Ultimate Team as well, uh, let me know what players you guys pulled, what your lineup is looking like. I'm curious to see. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to get flashed, please be sure to share and like this video. To stay updated, click subscribe and also follow GFlash on Twitter.